but um, would you cool if you're still here? Yeah. If not, yeah, go ahead. Right, I'll be back, chat. This is OK, yo. I'll be right back. Maybe. Yes, I will. Yeah, no worries. Well, getting into the first game of winner's semi, we got Larry versus Charlie. Or, wow, I didn't mean to say that. Larry versus Nico, I'm sorry. <laughs> Larry recently just came back from his win off of uh, off of All In yesterday, taking first place. So let's see if he can continue on his streak, or if Nico's gonna be the one to stop him. Funny enough, Nico is actually the uh, the third seed at this tournament. It's uh, Charlie, then Larry, then Nico. So Nico's got some work to do to prove that he is still the top dog over here in SoCal. Almost leaving that air dodge. Okay, are we gonna get the forward throw? Not gonna really go for anything. Oh my god, he turned around and shielded you, sent an extra shield damage. Another forward throw. Dashback finally gonna kill Char er, Nico, not even getting a chance to switch out to shield. No jump for Larry, gonna take that first stock of revenge immediately. So 0-0 zero, zero now. Shield, yeah, don't even think about it. Don't try to hit me with the combo when I got my shield all up. Oh my gosh, I'm see. And now both of the players just kind of go back and forth. It really is just kind of shifting between who gets the momentum. Right now it's just even percents too, but Buster already is going to make sure that does not stay the same. Our back air is not going to kill just yet. Great DI from Nico. F tilt, still not going to kill. Not the greatest move for dealing, but yeah, oh, he's dead now. Was a really great down tilt, calling out the fact that Nico did air dodge the stage to avoid the laser. Nico just kind of had the perfect, he had the perfect positioning there. So Larry up a considerable amount. I do believe the last time they played that Larry was actually the, the victor. Let's see if history going to repeat himself. Gonna go for a back throw this time instead of a forward throw. Check the back here, but Nico coming down aggressively with the fair. Back of his own, still not going to kill. Golly, he died. So Larry gonna take that first game with a two stock. Let's see how Nico's gonna answer. Just running it back to PS2. Dash tag. Nico not choosing to switch over to the shield art. I think he was just okay with taking that damage. He could die here. Oh, great tech. Great tech from Larry Lur. That, that could have been really bad. Only taking, what, 13% or going off the stage and trying to get that uh, down air. Hello. All right, Larry trying to come down aggressively with that back air, but still not hitting. Great spot dodge, actually. Dodging there. Nico has him on the ledge. This is so scary for him. He doesn't know what to do. Goes two frame with that forward air. That fair is just so, it's such a big hitbox. It's so aggressive. All right, that dash attack. I like that. I like that Nico went for that upbeat really to get Larry off the, uh, off the ledge and away from him. Perry, but Shulk's back is still a little too safe to do anything about it. It's about for first stock in 10, both plays at such high percents. Alright, here's the 
scary part. Shulk with Smash Art with him, Nico on the ledge. This is where stocks get taken. Or not, I've been wrong. Right, Nico up beat, just kind of eating out Char or Larry's Nair. First stock, I think. No, Bakko wasn't gonna kill. I think Larry's just trying to get his pummels in to see what would happen. A B, not even crossed it. No, barely killing Nico. Finally cracking on the first stock. Let's see how he's gonna be able to play with the sleep. So 183%. Nothing to scoff at. Can't really eat any of these back airs or these dash attacks or back there near the ledge. But I doubt Nico, Nico's gonna put himself in a position to get back aired or back thrown. Good pairing. Gets that up B for that good damage. Nico's playing beautifully, even though he's at this high percent. Yep. Larry had to go for that Wolf Flash there. Gonna get that F Smash. Now up 2-1, to one, or 3-1. to one. And F Till finally gonna take it 0-0, zero, zero, but Nico does have two clean stocks. This isn't completely out of the way for Larry. He does just need to start getting these hits in. Oh, I think he was waiting out the shield art, and I think that was a really good mind game because Nico usually goes for that at these uh, lower percents to avoid taking damage. So he just kind of conditioned Larry into not even hitting him. Oh, goes for that meaty up B. That's so scary because if Nico put out that downer, that would have been it. Oh, good tech. That was so scary, that was about to be it, but Nico didn't have enough time to set himself back up to get that stock. Good thing he did tech the Wolf Flash though, and it didn't spike him. That could have been really bad. Still, 99%. Larry needs to find an answer to Nico's second stock here. It's starting to get out of hand. Nico finally calls out the jump with that f tilt. This is not out of the range of possibility. He's up airs. Wow, hold up. He's he's getting juggled. This is Larry. Oh, he's popping off right now. Taking the damage. Even in this right back up. That backer almost connecting. After almost going cross eight. Now this is scary. You have to, have to play so well against this because one wrong move and Nico will kill you. Wait out that smash art. Larry not choosing not to run in. I think that was a really smart option. Going in for that dash grab. Not the best idea. Little flashback they get punished by Nico. Jumping right into that up tilt, Larry. Uh, not the greatest decision, but you know, it happens sometimes. Nico, that up tilt beautifully placed. Gonna now even it up at 1 1 apiece. How's everyone's night going, guys? We got this exciting winner semis. Both these players are just so good. And once they start playing with momentum, it's just so hard to, to just keep them down. Starting off with an early lead. Oh, tries to charge out that F-Smash, but great Nair coming out from, Le er, from, Le er, from Nico. Oh, interesting backslash from Nico. You imagine if that hit. Oh, Larry is avoiding these backslashes. Why don't you hit me with a good move? Mind the smash heart left, but still not a great position. Deep fair, covering so much, op so many options, especially for Wolf who has that linear recovery. Of course, that boosted F tilt really missing. It's yeah, that was so interesting. The fact that like Nico was still like stuck at the ledge, but he just wasn't even scared of him. He even just fought his way out. And that's a, that's just a testament to what like a good player does. Like even in those situations, where, like man, I'm in the corner, but if I don't freak out, if I keep calm. I could still come out of this uh, and be good. Oh, 
Oh, no jump. Not gonna go for the down air. Go into the shield, yep. Go into the shield for the reduced knockback and going immediately into the jump. That's something I've been noticing Nico do a lot more. Oh, jumped up with the aggressive fair. That was really good. Get off me, please. Let him be near me. That was such a scary position. Oh, yeah, going right into the shield. Right, I do not want to die as early than I need to. But I do like that Larry still went for it because it still would have got him damage. Fast attack almost killed him off the top. Smash Art not doing him any favors there. That should be it. Yep, back there. I take that second stock away. Let's see how Larry starts playing now because this first, this game has definitely been like Nico playing, just playing so well and playing so ahead, and then Larry having to catch up. But now we're even stocks, only 7% on Nico. Go for the tomahawk, but grab in the wrong direction. I don't know if he was expecting a roll or something, or that was just a misinput. Oh, hold up! There's no jump here. Does go for that S F? Maybe expecting the wolf flash. Flash again. Going for the spawn. I think right now we're going to get one. And as I say it, that up to it almost killing Larry. This is so scary. He needs to find his way out. And that runoff fair is going to be it. Nico going up now 2 to 1. Again, just Nico has put Larry off the stage and just, you're not, you're not coming back. I don't know what you want from me. Game four, running it back to PS2. Honestly, a great stage. So let's see what kind of adjustments Larry is going to make because I'm assuming he does want to win this, you know, bring them through game five and such. No jump. Larry just kind of backing off, letting Nico do his space. Instead of trying to like punish something on shield, he wants to try to punish something at a whiff distance. Please don't. Okay, there we go. That was gonna be really scary if he like just neutral got up and, and died. Good tech from Larry. I like that Nico went out to try to punish the wolf flash, but I think he just used a weird option to do so. Oh, here's that damage. I don't care if you're in chill out, I'm still getting these hits off. It's just different. Oh, that's gonna be scary. Let's see if he's gonna be able to. Oh, the up B actually makes it. I thought. I'm sure even Nico was like, yeah, there's gonna be a wolf flash free. I tried to go for the double dash tag. Larry finally kind of getting his footing. But as I say that, Nico immediately just starts throwing him away again. Alright, that forward air. Too, a little bit punishable, gonna get that back though. Let's see if he's gonna be able to take that stock. Yeah, that is, that's such a difficult thing to deal with when he's coming down with that backslash. I guess you could try to parry it and get a, and throw off one of your faster moves, but I don't know, the risk reward isn't really up there. All right, two two now. Let's see if he can start getting a hit in. That shield is just doing wonders for him. He's getting that up here and immediately getting punished. Well, that's the nature of Shulk. It's kind of like that six-dimensional chest where it's like, all right, I want to hit him with a combo, but there is that chance he switches into this art. So do I go for it still and force out the art, or do I want to just back off and let him get back to stage? It's definitely one of those difficult questions that every player has a different opinion on. 
One of Smash's great philosophical questions. But enough about that. Gets that parry on the nair and taking an F-tilt in Buster. That dash attack not sending for or outward like Larry probably wanted to, but he's still getting his damage in that big back air. Gonna land. This is gonna be this is so scary. I like that Nico didn't try to go off for a down air, knowing that could have gone bad. It wouldn't have been it wouldn't have been too bad, but you know what, he just decided alright, let's just reset. I've been doing so well. I don't have to trip. Larry's starting to get something of his own. Up throw into another up air. 55%. Oh, these up airs are just doing work. Larry does have a chance to bring this back. Is he dead? Oh my god, he disappeared! Now we're going to game five. Good stuff to, to Larry. Again, game five, just running it back. Now we got this final game of Werner Semis. I really don't know how this is gonna go. This has been just, this has been the very definition of like what back and forth is. Try to go for that up air immediately, just trying to get that sock as early as possible. And already at 90%, Larry looking good this game, but really it doesn't matter unless you can take this stock because this Buster Arc is just eating you. And don't stand on the ledge too far, too. Too long. Taking that first stock, Nico. He's just so good at it. He's just so scary on the ledge. It's so difficult to like think of a good way to get off because once you start thinking about it, your ledge miss really runs out and you're getting forward aired. Oh, tries to go for that down air to try and take that cheeky stock. Up e. Oh, finds that roll in, but that boosted F tilt taking you know, covering so much. Uh, forward air almost killing. Now here we go. Nico has you on the ledge with that smash art, but finally running out. That was a good parry in the down tilt, but that was like max space, so he couldn't do anything. And I think you realize that too. Dash tax, still not killing. Down throw dash tag, you know, when you're in shield. Well, that F2 is actually just making him leave the stage. Let's see if Larry's gonna be able to bring this back because 100% unanswered is not, not a pretty look on you, Larry. That boosted F2, oh my gosh, unanswered percent. Nico is looking really good in this game five. Larry has a lot of work to do. I'm not gonna count him out just yet, but finally getting that first hit in. I was, I was wondering if we we're gonna get a clean, perfect stock. Well, these nails are gonna work. That back here, oh, just not killing. Larry definitely needed that stock. I thought he was. But you know, this onslaught is still going on. There he's keeping him at the ledge. Nico finally finding his way out. As I say that, comes out with another back air. Game five, last stock. Let's see if Larry has the juice. Let's go for that time shield. Minstring off from Nico. Oh, that is so scary. Gets that damage. Minstring off and going for the up B. Not even close, getting a double up here. Larry slowly pawing his way back in. Well, that nair hitting from I just don't even know how, how that hit. That back air, this is so scary. Perfect up B. 
Murray. Really just staying calm and just holding his shield, holding his ground, I think it's so important. What you want to do in these last hit situations, or last stock, I should say. Not quite hit yet. Right, getting close. Oh, that back here, he was starting it up, but just not hitting it yet. Larry does have an opportunity to close this out. He's already at 87, this is scary. Now you're on the ledge against Smash. Oh, I don't even care. See, now that Shield Heart is up, because this is your chance, you could get that hit. You don't really want to force it, but if you could find it, there's nothing you can really do. That forward throw. That's too with that F-Tilt. Is that F-Tilt going to kill? Yeah, no, I didn't think so. But that laser. Oh, I don't quite agree with the down air. I thought... I, I thought Larry was just going to nair him, and he was going to fly away.